Hey guys, it's Welcomes and boy do I have one for you today. I have a way for you to repeatedly farm the chests in Helltides. Don't believe me? Just watch and drop a subscribe because this deserves it. Now, I want to make this really clear. You can do this purely solo, but I would recommend doing this in a duo to make your own life easier. Now, in the title I mentioned Shaco, a disclaimer, Uber Uniques are only supposed to be able to drop on level 85 characters, however as a current it is bugged that you can drop on any level characters from the new Helltide Chest change. For those who don't know, Helltide Chest just got updated in the patch notes a few hours ago and they are now dropping Uniques. There's been 20 plus confirmed Shaco drops in the last 2 hours and I'm going to show you the most optimal way of farming on any character without having to kill any mob on most of your characters, just your main one. Now, there is clips online of a level 61 getting it, 73 getting it. It's ridiculous. That means any level can actually get it as long as they have World Tier 4 unlocked. This is vital. Now, what we're going to do is you're going to log on all the characters that you want to open the chest on and you are going to run them to the Helltide. It doesn't make a difference um, if you think they can kill mobs or not. All you're going to do is you're going to run them there and you're going to stand on the outskirts. You need to make sure you are in the zone though because if you are not, this exploit will not work. As you can see, we are in Helltide. We have got the duration there so we know where you're here but we are just on the outskirt of it. As soon as we get here... You're going to leave the game and you're going to move all your other characters. For simplicity's sake for this video, I'm only going to do the one. You are then, when you've moved all your characters there, going to log on your main character. Now, you need to farm cinders to open the chest. A Helltide chest for helms costs 75 cinders. And you, I have, say I had four characters, I would need 300 cinders. 75 for each one. But you can farm them all on this character. Okay, because I'm only going to do two on this, I'm going to farm 150 cinders and I'm going to get back to you. Okay, so we've flash forward. We have now got uh, 156 cinders. We are on our main character and we have found a gift of the helms. Best way to find the chest is just to look for gift of protection and find one on the map. You all know how to do that. That's not the exploit. So what's the exploit? Well, we are at the chest with our 156 cinders and we are going to open this gift of helms. We're going to go shako, shako, shako and we are going to drop... Not a shako. Okay, it was worth a shot, wasn't it? Because we didn't get it, that's okay. We're going to leave the game. We cannot click leave game. We can only sit there. We can't click the emergency leave game. We've got to wait the 10 seconds. If you press it, it doesn't work properly. We're going to trick the game to think we've disconnected. And that not sound strange, but we're going to log back into the game again. And what this does is this actually makes the game trigger a something and go, wait a minute, this person shouldn't be online. How are they online? What's going on? Now, when we've done this, we are going to log out a second time, okay? So we haven't moved, we're just going to again log straight out. Now, I would always make sure you are safe in the area because if you die halfway out, you can lose half your cinders. So, as soon as you've logged back out, you're going to go and log on to that alt. Which alt? The one that you had at the zone itself. Now, we also, I ran my Meteor Cubs just into the entrance. Because we logged our main character out and main character back in a second time, you will see we are all spawn inside and we have the 81 cinders that our main character had. We are now going to join onto our friend. As I said at the start, you want to have a duo. And when our friend accepts, we will transfer. We can now teleport to the town okay Airballs. so you can't teleport to town until you've actually logged in and you have the cinders but this cinders is now assessed to this character actually more importantly assessed to this account so as soon as you've teleported out i'm going to go and teleport is it safe for me to teleport to you uh fireballs fireballs cool there's no one so this is why communication is key guys you need to communicate with your teammate if you don't have a teammate you would have to run to the chest yourself and at low levels that can be very risky but that's why a teammate helps. Can I clear? There we go. So now we said clear. I'm going to teleport over now. And as I get there, you will see we will still not only have our 81 cinders. We will actually also be next to the chest and can open it. Now, because like I said, it is glitched currently. There's a chance you can get it. And as you can see, there's an ancestral helm. We dropped a 753 level 60 Ancestral, and it could have been one of the uniques. Now, if we had multiple characters we could do this on, we could then just repeat it, the uh, do this forward, 
and because I don't really care I didn't teleport immediately out what I would recommend to do is to teleport straight out so you don't lose any extra cinders but that's absolutely fine there's the second one opened and again as you can see we have three if I log back out now which I can use the immediately log out and I log back onto my main character uh, you will say I will also still have the three. More importantly, if I logged onto another character at this point, that character would have the three as long as it was logged out in the Helltide. And you could again do it again. Log on another character, teleport to town, teleport to friend, open the chest. When you've done all your characters, you then turn around and see, as you can see, he's still got his three. When you've done all your characters, you then turn around and... Uh, do the same for your friend back. It's as simple as that. Chests respawn on the hour, don't forget. So as soon as this chest is done, I can go and farm on this character now. And when the chests change location in 15 minutes time, I'll be able to do it again. Doubling your chances. It's as simple as that, guys. Again, take all the characters you want to open the chest to the Helltide and log out. Log on your main and farm enough cinders for all of your characters. Log out your main, log into your main, log out to your main, log into an alt, teleport to the chest, Done. Simple as that. You can do it, I can do it. Go farm it and get off your ass. Till next time, Cubs. Peace.